Hello and welcome to today's cryptocurrency technical analysis where I have a really special one for you today where we are going to be going through Bitcoin here to start off with, then taking a look at Cardano, which has been oh, mighty volatile over the past 24 hours. Really, it is a joy to be trading this one again. Uh, so I want to cover those two assets for you today, giving you the gifts and knowledge as always. I think you're going to absolutely love the video. So all I ask is for you to pay attention and learn something. That's all I want from you to this video. Learn something from me. With that said, let's go into Bitcoin. Um, so, I mean, fairly simple, really. Currently sat at all time highs. Um, am I, do, I hope I don't, do I appear euphoric? Do I appear extremely uh, emotional or excited right now? No, not really, to be honest with you. I'm just trading the charts for what they are. Still looking for short positions if they are there. Obviously holding on to swing long positions. Three longs that I still hold are for the swing trades, obviously from $29,000, actually have another one, $28,000. 39,500 and obviously from that invert from the head and shoulders fake out that we saw back off of the monthly those three long positions I do currently still hold on Bitcoin so swing long positions but that's not to say I'm not going to be taking shorts on rises okay with short positions we have to be very precise with our entries and we need to not get greedy e.g take profit okay take profits because the trend obviously is up so that's something to bear in mind. So what could we say is a sign of weakness here on the Bitcoin chart? I don't want to go too in-depth and too sort of advanced. I want to keep this fairly simple for you in this video. Um, what do we have, first of all? We obviously broke all-time high yesterday. And what did this level back test? You might be thinking, well, this was a really random level to find support and go up. I will show you now what it was. Fairly simply, it was the old previous all-time high. So the previous all-time high was broken and then back tested as support for another move to the upside obviously from that next move to the upside we are starting to see a bit of a retracement here potentially so what are we envisaging first of all well we have a range low and we have a potential range high so the first thing we can envision is a range surprise surprise you start to see the commonalities of um you know the, the, the occurrences here we look to form a range we have a low, we have a high. We do not get bearish down here. We do not get bullish up here. You know, we just look to trade these ranges from the one minute to the 15 minute to the daily time frames. Okay, when you have a nice range, it's brilliant. Okay, overall, the trend is up. So what could we say is, you know, if the trend continues, we're just you know looking for higher prices. 69,000, obviously a big level, <laughs> big meme level anyway. Um, so to the downside then, well, $66,666. As you saw, well, I hope you paid attention yesterday. You see the high here, 66666. We hit it to the absolute dollar for a tracement to the downside, obviously for a continuation up. Should, should we fall down here? 66666 level of support, obviously down to around that 65,900 zone. So I'm going to call this a zone definitely. And we obviously have our support zone down here. Losing this, of course, it's going to look very bearish. Not going to like that, but that would look quite bearish, yeah? But while, it's that, while, it, while we maintain the uptrend, while we maintain support holding, we're not going to be, oh, this is extremely bearish. We're going to trade the charts, you know, maintaining swing longs because we're in a big, big, big uptrend. Look for shorts. You know, I've taken a few, you know, I've actually taken several shorts during this uptrend. And you might think, oh, Daniel, why do you try and shorten uptrend? This is a really bad idea. La, 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 la. Well, truly, if you know what you're doing in this market, you can make a lot of money shorting in a bull market. And I know some people are going to say, never short in a bull market, X, Y, and Z. Well, I would always flip that on its head and say, even in a bull market, even in a strong trending market, I will still take the majority of my trades as short positions. Why? Because I like to hedge. I like to be protected. And well, I personally still think you can make money, <laughs> even you know, trading the shorts, even in, even in an uptrend. Of course, you have to be very good at taking profit, not get greedy. And of course, you have to get you have to get pretty good entries. You know, you can't afford to be getting poor entries. You have to be pretty precise. But if you have the technical skills, then hey, you might as well take the trade if it's there. No, trade the charts. So this was a really quick overview of Bitcoin because I want to focus on Cardano here. But, but so overview of Bitcoin currently all time highs. The back test of the old all time highs uh, was tested as resistance flipped into support for another move to the upside. We have a current range forming here. If we break to the downside, six 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 to the daily level of support. Losing this, of course, much more bearish meme level sixty nine k above us. <laughs> so that was the quick overview there of Bitcoin. And now I want to focus on Cardano. Actually, I want to do two announcements, and these are for your benefit, not mine. The two announcements that I want to give you here are first of all. 
obviously on the community page on our YouTube for absolutely free every Tuesday and Thursday we are doing the free community post so of course today being a Tuesday there has been a free community post okay you can come over to our YouTube on your phone or on your computer click on the community tab here you will see hey what a beautiful photo click on read more and you can read our community posts okay every tuesday every thursday new community post go over make sure you read them obviously the last one that we gave you on sheep well that one ended in a in, in a in a 50 percent plus trade so there's very good information all i would ask for you like on this video if you enjoy what we're doing hit that like button you know it's a really nice way to say thank you for absolutely free hit the likes drop a comment if you're feeling extra nice and you know just it just helps out a lot so if you want to be nice smash that like button drop a comment down below um so yeah just wanted to remind you all of that as the first announcement that the community posts are here and then the second announcement before we get over to cardano here is a bit of an unfortunate one i suppose that we even have to kind of mention this and that is the the scammers that are out in absolute force i mean they're commenting on the youtube videos commenting on I mean, everything like you need to be very, very, very careful. I want to keep this short and sweet because we've already given thousands of reminders of this. But please be careful. Please be careful. We are, of course, just chart champions. That is chart singular champions, plural. We are not charts champion, charts champions chart champions with a zero instead of an O. You know, the scammers, they're, they're pretty clever with the way that they are wording some of the things. But just be careful. We are just chart champions spelt correctly. The correct spelling. We do not use Telegram. Anybody offering services on Telegram, pretending to send videos, etc., is a scammer. This is illegal. And of course, we will be taking legal action. But in the meantime, you've got to be very cautious of this. So we do not use Telegram. Do not send anybody money on Telegram. Unfortunately, today, somebody got scammed. They sent over one Ethereum to the scammer. You know, this is thousands of dollars thrown away down the drain because, of course, they received nothing in return. So pause the screen and read this, please. Pause the screen and read this because it's just very, 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 very important. You know, I hate to see people getting scammed and it just can be easily avoided if you just pay close attention. Chart champions, okay? On the YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, <laughs> Facebook, you know, Chart Champions, chartchampions.com. It's the only place you'll get content, not charts, champions, or any other spelling, okay? Read this, be careful, and if you do have a contact at Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter, let us know, and we'll try and get verified. That will obviously help out. And of course, if you have a contact within Telegram, also, please let us know, and we can basically have this the, the scam groups uh, deleted easily without having to waste so much time with lawyers. But anyway, that's all there for your announcements, okay? So with that said, I wanna move over to Cardano. Just please remember those two announcements, community posts and only chart champions. We, we are not gonna send you DMs, etc. Anyway, just read this, pause the screen, read it. Let's move on now to Cardano. So Cardano, Whew. <laughs> what a video, what a day. So Cardano, well, I really, 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 really hope that you paid attention to my live stream that I'd done not that long ago, 29th of October, where I literally handed this for free on a plate to everybody. Told you exactly what to look for. Wait for the loss of the la of, wait for a loss of the monthly with a swing failure pattern of the lows. That's gonna get gift you a long trade. I said that one as some people were commenting. <laughs> Your mental is inspirational. People like my thinking. People like the brain. That's real knowledge. It absolutely was. And guess what? A Cardano went exactly as per it did what did it do it done a swing fair pattern of the lows if we zoom out here onto a higher term time frame you see this low here that was swing failure pattern yesterday again if you struggle to recognize swing failure patterns if you lack confidence in your trades if you know you it's reaching these lows and you're scared you know you're looking for shorts i remind you to just study our content really hard and if you want that extra bit of knowledge of me acknowledging the trade is still there when obviously in the champions group yesterday at the very lows here at two o'clock saying cardano ada finally with the swing failure pattern of the lows we obviously were waiting for it and then when it happened i am not hesitating i'm telling my team the swing failure patterns there you know the the trade is here <laughs> obviously <laughs> this was Oh, trading assistant shorting Shiba coin yesterday. <laughs> anyway, with my analysis, it was on Cardano. And I was, 
you know, after the swing fair pattern of the lows, split stayed very patient for it. Obviously, basically just made a plan, stuck to that plan, and you know, um, traded it very well. What can I say? Obviously, we see now up to today. And we can see, wow, what a great trade Cardano turned out to be. So what happened with Cardano? Well, let's cover this now. So first of all, why did we find support where we found support? Obviously, for a swing fair pattern of the last prior lows. OK, very important. Uh, something to do with emotions and psychology. Well, many people, um, you know, let's just think about this. How many people are going to be buying down here? The answer is not very many people. Most people are going to be shilling you this coin up at the absolute high, which is where obviously I was reminding people, this is a really big resistance. Go and watch my videos back in August, September. I was saying, do not buy Cardano here. You are buying into the massive, massive CC resistance from all time high to the low. OK, be, take a bit of caution. This is where most people are going to be, you know, most gurus on YouTube, e.g. in my opinion, the scammers, they're going to be, you know, shilling this up here come down to support, you know, there's not a lot of interaction, not a lot of people talking about it. This is the place where I'm interested in longing. This is the place where I'm interested in shorting. Okay. So if we zoom down onto a lower term time frame here and take a look at this, even if you don't trade Cardano, this is still interesting. So again, yesterday, alerting my team, as soon as we hit the uh, swing failure pattern of the lows, I'm telling my team, hey, we've done the swing failure pattern. Obviously, this is the time to be interested. This is the time we have been waiting for. OK, this is what we've been waiting for. No hesitation. Let's go. So the, I will show you here very interestingly. So this is the low of the swing failure pattern. If you miss the low of the swing failure pattern, what is a very safe trade? What well, would be a retest of the CC, especially once you've seen confirmation of myself talking about the swing failure pattern. Fibonacci from low up to the high of that move. You can see really clearly we come into and back test the CC for an extreme move to the upside. OK, well, let's say. You miss this move and you miss that CC and if then had a very big move to the upside. What can you look for next? Well, you can look for your SR flips and really simply have a guess what happens here. Fibonacci from the low up to the high. We hit the CC there to the exact sat. Look in the top left, the low 3117, the low of the CC is 3117. There is no randomness in this market. That is what you call chart champions once again running this market, back testing 3117 to the absolute south of the CC there. Okay. Obviously, we saw a very, very, very big bounce today, currently up 7%. This is a big, big, big bounce for a trader like myself. Obviously, Again, I don't want this video to go on too long, really, but I am obviously, well, it's not obvious, I suppose, but I am trading Cardano against Tether on Bybit. I only trade the, the pair on Bybit. I am doing my analysis here on Cardano BTC. So obviously, when I am acknowledging we are hitting these levels on the BTC pair, I am taking action on the Tether pair because I do not trade Binance. I do not trade Coinbase. I do not trade FTX. I only trade Bybit. So I have to use the analysis on ADA BTC and then convert this over to the Cardano tether pair where yesterday obviously we were we were basically you know strongly moving above two dollars. Um now trading at two dollars uh two nine two. So that's the way for to, to remove confusion how I'm doing my trades. I'm, I'm actually placing a lot of emphasis on the BTC pair, although I'm not even trading it, because I feel that this is the one. This is the this is just how I trade altcoins. Again, if this is confusing at all to you, um, I just kind of really recommend you the Chart Champions Contender membership because I explain this in so much detail. Okay, because so many people are confused about this. It's not the easiest way of trading, but it is with one hundred percent the most effective. What can I say? It it just works. So taking the Fibonacci then from the high of the overall impulsive move to the upside to the lows, you can see surprise. What have we banged down into here? Well, the CC Fibonacci is like every time frame right now. I've, uh, CC Fibonacci is really good. Uh, we came into the CC and we've obviously seen a pullback. For me, this is a very good take profit one. Obviously, I had a very nice entry of the swing failure pattern. When we're moving up to these price targets, when we're moving up to such resistances, this is a big take profit one. Yeah, even though there is potential of a lot of upside, that is just at the moment potential. We have a potential of a really big move up here on Cardano. But to see a really big move up, we need to get past these resistances. By the time I've uploaded this, could we have broke through this? Yes, of course we could have. But right now it's resistance. Right now, if you manage to catch the lows, 
and I know 100% people in the group did because they have already thanked me this morning of saying thank you for the Cardano heads up. Um, this is a good take profit. Nobody ever lost money by taking profits. Okay, if we reach, if we breach this resistance and claim it as support, guess what? We can look to compound. We can compound the positions. Right now, let's just take a bit of caution off of these resistances. If you miss the long of the lows, well, this is why you need the champions group <laughs> because you wouldn't have missed it then. But if you did miss it, you don't really want to long into the CC level. Do whatever you want, but I would not really long here. You know, this for me is a take profit. Why? Well, I literally, because I long lower, and that is the main reason. This is a take profit. So that's the way that I would approach this right now. Obviously, the monthly, extremely key level of support now. Of course, if we lose the low of this move, as I've said before, Cardano would have a really big potential drop to the downside. So this is like the must hold support. So nice to see, you know, double digit bounce there. Really, really, really nice. Has a potential of a bigger move, but currently we, we were obviously at, at, at a resistance. Okay, breaking this is going to be extremely key. Um, then we can start to look, well, we're a long way off of bump and run patterns. So we'd have to put in some sort of basing pattern here. Okay, again, we could move up and envision a range. Yeah, it could even do the range. There's the high of the range and then come all the way back down again and just form a bit of a basing pattern here. That's no need to worry. Really, that's no need to wouldn't This isn't the time to worry. This is the time, obviously, for financial opportunities. Um, oh, yes, I forgot about I was gonna, I was gonna talk. I, I just looked at this, of, of course, as well. Welcome to our new subscribers, and then Crypto Cohen, the Moon Bit Boy, and Satoshi. I hope that you are enjoying the content here. Um, yes, that is something to learn. Even, even the people here do not short support. Do not long resistance because I know that you are very keen on doing that. So I, hopefully you learn with me today. You long support and short resistance. You do not long every day the breakouts and short the breakdowns because guess what? That only gets people wrecked. We don't want that here. We want people to learn. So nice to see you subscribe to the channel. Welcome, even though I'm probably a nemesis. Um, <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, that was basically the Bitcoin analysis that I've talked you through here. I've talked you through Cardano. I've told you how I got to all these levels and uh, said welcome to our new fans. <laughs> and I've also given you reminders of to be careful against the scammers, not just these scammers, but of course, the, the big scammers here. Please take care. Please, 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 please take care. Um, so, yeah. Community post Tuesday and Thursday. We're having scammers. Talk to you through Bitcoin. Talk to you through Cardano. Is there anything else before I end? Yes, there is one final thing, of course, and that will be the <laughs> that will be our disclaimer of, of course, no financial advice. This is a video for your educational purpose only, entertainment, education, um, not financial advice. So yeah, hope you've enjoyed. If you want to see more over in chartchampions.com. Smash that like button as hard as you can. Oh yeah, there's one final thing. I'll do this in the next video. I'll do this in the next video. For now, hope you've enjoyed. Smash that like and thank you ever so much. Have a good day, everybody, and take care. Bye.